Um, that will see out there. So obviously, if I do come to yours next week, then I won't be streaming on that Sunday evening. There we go. Why is that not on? Is it time? Um, oh, yeah. Is it time? Yeah. It is time. Why? Oh, oh, there we go. I'm in, I'm in the online life. Oh, what's that? Yeah. This is, uh, this is my new tactic. Yeah, I mean, that's pretty safe. I mean, I've got entirely unblockable stuff if, if I can get to any of it. <laughs> Um, well, I should be able to get to a five cost relatively all right. Just that uh, I can't believe you didn't bring me P Professor X. I know that was a real curveball. I, swear, I swung you there. Uh, disgusting behaviour. Um, Could quickly get rid of Wolverine, which he wouldn't be that that, bad, that worried about me losing to put PXG in. But but no, no, my fault. Um, yes. Hello there, uh, one other person. It might be me. <laughs> oh, are you watching as well? Are yeah. You? Uh, hello, Alex. Um, Hi. Um, <laughs> um, yeah. <coughs> so we've we've made it to Deadpool, Deadpool and Doctor Strange. Although I think we've seemed to have foregone Doctor Strange. Uh, for, yeah, I forgot about Doctor Strange. Yeah. Um, no. Oh, Wong would have been really good actually with um, red eyes. Yeah, Wong. Yeah, Wong's the big thing from that one, isn't it? But I never got my hands on it. So have you not got it? Have you? No. Oh, I sold a copy to. I think it was Danny. Ah. Uh, not too long ago. And no, I, Doctor, I, I never saw the. I never saw the team pack anywhere. I've never found it to to buy. Um, I think I have Max Dice for that one. I think the only one I don't have Max Dice for is um, the Superman Wonder Woman set. Mm. I didn't, but I got some extra dice, so I have some of the Max Dice, <laughs> okay. but not all of them. Yeah. So yeah, we've made it to this Deadpool set, which is um, it's okay. There's some good bits in it. But it's, there, there are some excellent cards. The, it's the, just not meta defining. No, no. It's not like some of these sets you come in and you're like, I have to play this card now. That's it. I mean, if if PXG were to rotate, then multiple man becomes more fun. Yeah. More useful, but again, not massively useful. More useful. Yes, the swarm's always a. She's a she's a tricksy mistress swarm. Yeah. Yes. Definitely. So, um, I've gone back to no cards again. <laughs> nice. Yeah, I to be honest, I've been in a pub all day, so. Fair enough. Um, yeah. Yeah, football season started. I wonder if there's a, a link between the football season and my team, mm. team building. Yeah, maybe, maybe. I, I mean, I only finished the team off like an hour. Well, not even an hour ago. So. I should have most of these cards, to be fair, but um, yeah. Yeah. Probably. Yeah. Um. But yeah, so yes, we're we're doing Deadpool. Um, and to be honest, I just kind of tried to build a team. I tried to obviously when we do this, you try and build a team for the um, set rather than obviously just build the most meta team because otherwise we play the same thing every week. Um, he says with Jinzo, so <laughs> yeah. But I've I've kind of pivoted my wing condition into trying to come up with something for this team so for the very first time i have no pxg i've, I've oh. not brought it at all I'm um, disgusted. i know because i instead i decided to try this brand new there's a, a max six dice swarmer uh, no, of no. multiple man so you must have a lot to get all six oh you don't have six of dice no. i don't I, I don't know i feel like i might have in my big bag of dice but i'm i don't want to go through that no. um, it's, uh, conveniently though it's the same dice as um, Gambit uh, Gambit yeah from the first set so so I decided there was no point having him and PXG because that's just silly um, <laughs> so it's, I've got worse PXG um, yeah. yeah so then for my wing con I looked at obviously Bob Agent of Hydra because um, when he's active Deadpool character dice gain fast um, yep which obviously is very good. And then Kidpool. So uh, if I have an active Deadpool character die other than Kidpool, Kidpool gains deadly. So you've suddenly got this fast deadly character. Very unpleasant. Um, 
then I've kind of got my you normal stable pieces: Jinzo, Captain Cold's Cold Gun, and Parallax. Uh, mm. for, it's Parallax we've not seen for a while, but basically, is global is use one generic, roll any number of dice before your attack step, um, and I mean a relatively useful um, actual ability of when he's active once per turn. If you have at least one of each type of energy in your reserve pool, you may purchase an acting dice for one energy and add it to yeah. your prep area. So it could be worse. I I mean, I've got some really good ones of those. Yeah. Um, and then the other part of my wing con was Outlaw, Quick Draw. During the attack step, if you have any dice in your prep area, Outlaw gets plus two attack and plus two defense, which would make her basically a, a four attack character with fast, which is pretty mm. decent. Um, okay. Sorry, I guess. Yeah. Um, then I went with Villainous Pack, just for the prep global, basically. Um, yeah. And... I went for feedback because uh, I've got a deadly character. I don't know. It kind of, yeah, that was my okay. thinking. Yeah. Interesting. Yeah. Yep. Not the greatest thing, but um, I, I was going to be very aggro and attacky. So I thought that was what I was going for. Yeah. Fair play. Yeah. My, my basics are basically chosen around that sort of thing as well. I'll come to them in a minute, but <laughs> mine, I, I, I've looked at this flying car. I mean, I've got, I've got. I'll start with the actual. The wing con is X twenty three blades of rage, which is the super rare from this set. I've got my hands on one of those early, um, but it basically says when X twenty three attacks, roll all dice in all players' prep areas for each energy rolled. X twenty three gets plus two A. Return all rolled dice to their respective prep areas. So that's a bit of crazy chaos. I thought to. Help me with that. I've got two cards that are six and seven cost. <laughs> this is going to be a, a slow game for me. <laughs> so I've got one from the Yu-Gi-Oh set. Red Eyes, Blue, Black Dragon, Inferno, Fire Blast. When this monster attacks, knock out all sidekicks of both players. This monster gets plus 2A for each sidekick knocked out this way. So I can I can choose the the order of this. So I can basically knock out all sidekicks from both sides, gain plus two attack for each sidekick knocked out, and then roll them all, and then give her attack as well. So that's kind of fun. It's a little combo, a six and a, seven, a five. And then add in a seven cost. This is uh, Tarask, the Epic Aberration, another super rare. Uh, he has re Regenerate. Um, and he has, when Tarask regenerates, knock out all of your opponent's character dice of equal or lower level. So hopefully, knock him out with, with blue eyes. I've got blue eyes, white dragon. Uh, knock him out with blue eyes, then re regenerate him, hopefully on level 3, and knock out all of your characters. Then, yeah, then this doesn't come out, but at least... He, he he's bigger yeah and then with her out then i can re-roll all of your dice and yeah have some fun with it so but again a a five a six and a seven cost uh to get those i've got blue eyes white dragon and nothing else um <laughs> um i've also got as a backup which i will probably need now is merlin he can only be blocked by crossover character dice. Yuck. Yeah, sorry about that. Um, and he has the Bolt uh, Psychic Fixer. So I've got a small, very, very small amount of ramp. Very small. Um, I've also found this new card called Flying Car. Buckle up. Uh, so it says target character die you control gets plus 3A and plus 3D and loses all character abilities. But crucially, once he's already attacking, I can then use it just to give him the buff. Yeah. Uh, so that's fun. And I've got Black Widow, Natasha. She can't be blocked unless your opponent spins down one of their character dice. So if you've only got psychics, then you can't do that. Again, I can then use that on her once she's on. She's not blocked. Or if you block her, I can then just give her massive stats to knock out some of your things. 
Finally, I've got from the new set Wolverine, Lord of Vampires. You're one of your favourites. Oh, I remember being absolutely destroyed <laughs> by this card. The X Vampires will feed. So while Wolverine, Lord of Vampires, is active, when an opposing character die is KO'd, he deals one damage to target opponent, and you gain one life. So yeah, that's just a timer once he gets out. Um, and then psychic uh, basics. I've gone for Cowabunga. If you have exactly one character die in the field, so it gets plus four A and overcrush until the end of turn. Again, could be really kind of fun. Um, if you have more than one character die in the field zone, instead all of your character dies get plus one A. So again, not too bad. And then end of days. This is the this is the fun kicker. Uh, each player chooses one of their active character dice and KOs the rest. So yeah, I really need PXG in this one, but we'll see. We'll see how it goes. Um, <laughs> it could be good. Please. I've got three dice that cost seven, four dice that cost seven, and three dice that cost six, and a lot of six dice that cost five, so it's not going to be a quick game for me today. So, you better get, get oh, a move on. Yeah. So, I'll just have to wait until you kill me. That's basically it. Okay, well, at least I brought you... I brought you villainous packs, you know, something. Well, that is something, actually. Villainous packs. Um, I, I got three and two. So. I got one and none. One and one. Okay. Two. One so, and two. One and two. Okay, so I will go second. Okay. Most, most definitely that time. Right. Ready. Uh, how? Let's see if let's keep those. See if we can get ourselves another mask. Oh, I couldn't get a single mask. Rubbish. Okay, that's fine. Uh, for the sidekick and pay two or pay two for a morph and morphin man. Not a morphin man. A multiple man. Mighty Morphin Lord Power Ranger. That's the one. That'd be a great set, actually. That would be good fun. I'm sure one of the very talented members of the community could could uh, organise that. Oh, well, this is a psychic. I actually want psychics. So I could use that to prep it and get a flying car. So I could still choose that one, couldn't I? Just to get four, four attack, three attack and three defence. Yeah. Um... I kind of feel that I need him. Am I going to do a turn one prep? Or am I going to get a flying car? Hmm. Uh, I'm going to do... So I either get a Black Widow and a turn one prep. Or I get a prep which is that and I get a flying car. I'm gonna buy. I'm gonna buy one of her, and I'm gonna do a turn one prep, which is madness. But there you go. All right. Pop, priority in turn. That's another sidekick, but we don't like those at all. Mhm. Mm That's perfect. We do like that very much, right? So there's four. Do I buy? Eh. Yeah, I think that's the way to do it. Uh, I don't want to do something <coughs> else. Mm. No, I think that's definitely what to do. Right, um, pay two for a multiple man. And <laughs> prep five. And field a sidekick. Okay. Over to cool. you. Cool, cool. Alright, it's going to be one of these dice. Sidekick. Okay. I am rolling five dice. So the perfect roll would be a one of each energy, a bolt, and uh, no, it's a psychic. Okay, well I could do that to buy almost a Tarask, you know. Um, discount. No, no, it's going to be a six, isn't it? Uh. Right. 
that. Um, I can make that a bolt. The good thing with the Wolverine Lord of Vampires is it doesn't say I can't spin question marks. So if I kept that, I could roll that to anything else. And I could buy a Wolverine Lord of Vampires. Right, let's try it. Okay, right, so let's figure this out. Um, I can make that a bolt, and then that could be a mask, and then I can knock out that to get the two disc in. Yeah, so I'm going to spin that down to a bolt. Got to do this while I can, really, haven't I? Yeah. Uh, knock that out for a two discount. Which means I could either buy Red Eyes, but I'm going to buy Wolverine, because I've got the four different energy types. Wolverine, Lord of Vampires. Yes. All right. Go. Last in turn. That's good. That's good. That's good. That's, you know what, That's, I could do much worse than that, in fact. So... Uh, but I don't want to prep. I want to prep those and then buy one so that I don't. I don't know. Yeah, that definitely makes more sense. Right. Uh, pay one to field a multiple man. Put sidekick out. Prep using villain's pact. And. Oh, do I want. Oh, no, because he can then go in my bag, but I've got a chance of. Prepping him, and it's a pretty. Uh, that's fine, because I'll be drawing four anyway, and that's going to go there. So I think that's a pretty good choice. Yeah, let's do that, and then spend two on a multiple man, and then I'll pass priority and turn. Okay. Uh, at least you've been having fun on your turns. All I all I do is buy multiple men. Well, you know, it's uh, it's, it's interesting. I'm playing the long that, game. That turn one prep got me a Wolverine. It did. Right, okay, so I've got a 1 in 6 chance of getting a Wolverine Lord of Empires. I didn't, okay, well that's fine, I'm happy with that. I've got 5 in my bag, so if I prep this turn, then I will definitely... <sighs> right, get... You know what, I've almost got all the energies again if I get the bulk <laughs> down, <laughs> which is kind of crazy. Um... Flying car. Um, I kind of want to roll that again. The psychic is useful in itself. That gives me any energy I want. Gives me a bolt. I could actually just spin that down and get an X23 or a Merlin, but. Um, do I need masks? Fists. I don't technically need fists. Um, so I'm going to keep those. Yeah, I'll keep a mask because I can prep with it. Okay, well that's exactly what I had before. Um, so I feel the side kick. I could spin it down, but that's a prep. That gives me three. Hmm. Um, you've got a mask, which is a prep. Oh, okay. <laughs> do I want to get into the whole parallax loophole? I don't think I do. What's that? Um, I'm actually kind of tempted to get with one of these carbungas just for the fun. Um, Those people. Um, let's spin that down to a bolt. Pay four either for a cowabunga or a flying car. I'm going to go for a cowabunga at the minute. And then I'm going to prep one of these. 
it's the it's the Wolverine. And then pass right in turn. Okay, right. Yeah. Two in the bag. What if we get two sidekicks? You just know it. Oh no, perfect. Right, one swarm. Okay, that's fine. And that means I've got a guaranteed swarm for next time, which is pretty nice. Yep. Perfect. Right, okay, that's a lot of sidekicks. But I feel, really feel like I should be buying something that is not a sidekick. You can't buy any sidekicks. No, that's <laughs> that's ex it's a fair point you make there, right? <laughs> well, in theory, you could spin one down, knock out two for a four discount. Yeah. Luckily, there aren't that many globals for para uh, for Jinzo. Um. No. I mean, there are some, but there aren't in that many. Right. Yeah, that's one of those. I think that's a pretty good turn, so let's do that. Uh, I'm just going to buy myself a Bob, Agent of Hydra. Nice. Field two sidekicks, and... Oh, do I want to field two sidekicks? <coughs> I want to spin one down next turn and so knock one out, so it's not the end of the world. And then buy multiple men. You can, I think you can only do that on your turn. The, the yeah. Spin down. yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry, I meant like my next turn. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. So I'm not going to stress about it. No. Fair enough. Okay. All yours. Wolverine, come on. Come on, Wolverine. Don't be a dick. Ah, he is so far. Right. So, those are good. The rest are going to be going because I want psychics. Oh, yes. Or a three fielding cost. That's fine. I can cope with that. An 8-8. Eight, eight. There we go. Let's put it over there because you can actually see him. Great. Yeah, that's all right. Yeah. Um, one. So I'm going to. Um, probably just do a prep. Uh, I could, I could pick, I could blue eyes him off. <laughs> <laughs> Seems entirely mad, but I could do that. There we go. I've got me cowabunga. Excellent. That could be a 12 overcrush if I do that right. <coughs> Which would be pretty funny. Cool, uh, 10. Yeah, uh, I think. Eight. Would you let through an 8 attack? I'm still on max health, so I wouldn't get his ability that much. Some prep. Um, no, I'm going to leave him there. I'm okay. Leave him there. Right. One in the bag. Ask whether you would have blocked them. I don't know if you would or not. Oh, man, that's a great like... swarm. That's everything. Cool. Okay. That's very good. That's pretty good. I think I'll reroll mm -hmm. him. I'll reroll those. Mm -hmm. Those could be something else. So, uh, then you should try and get end of day just for the fun of it. That's pretty good as well. Him, I don't care about at all. Um, I may want to try rerolling, but if he comes back on character, I'd be <coughs> naff. Um, <laughs> <laughs> just pay to like parallax and parallax. You've got loads of energy. You can I have that. got so much energy, but <laughs> let's um, right. Let's feel the sidekick, spin it down. Do I have to spin it down to anything in particular? Bolt. Bolt. Okay. Yeah. Um, exactly what you need. <laughs> yeah. Right. If you want to buy outlaw, that is. So. It's a four. My last two. I need to field one. No, I'm going to be swarming. I'm going to be rolling everything every turn. Cool. Okay. Please. Just, just for the the memes. Oh, you are, yeah, you are now because you've got five psychics. Uh, yeah. Um. And him. And him. Right. Let's field a bob. Yep. 
for one. Um, then I think I'm going to blue eyes off a sidekick, more just to get rid of my sidekicks, if I'm honest. Um, mm -hmm. And that means I can buy one of them for two. Um, can't buy a pole gun. Can buy a feedback. I don't want a feedback. Uh, I'm just going to, and then you know what? I might. This is crazy. I'm going to just bolt off another sidekick. Okay. And pass priority and turn. That is extremely handy for me now. If I roll this, anyway. Because um, if I roll this, you now can't kill him. <laughs> Thankfully, because you've only got seven attack in the field. And as they're fast, that is very useful for me. Okay, right. So, um, masks. Do I want masks? I keep one mask. Keep the psychic because I can spin it down. Okay, fists. Do I need fists? Not in the slightest. Not. So, I don't really want that now. No, you really don't want that. So, I could kill it by another cowabunga. That seems to be the way to go right yeah, now. Yeah, that seems quite unpleasant. <laughs> yeah. Um, so, kill it, get a prep. Bite for two. I do kind of want to prep a die, but... I mean... No, that seems the way to go, right? So... I'm going to, but you could still let it through. But, and you've got no way of. Um, I mean, to be fair, you're going to be blocking most of it, so you're. I mean, you're only going to be taking like five, but you don't really want to be taking twelve, I don't think. So I'm going to field the sidekick. Well, I could just spin it down. Fist. Can I do anything with a fist? No. I'm not even looking at that that parallax label. <laughs> um, right. Uh, okay. So, could spin it down. Spin four on a flying car. No, I want the prep. So, I'm gonna KO it. Spin two. I like these car bungers. I'm having a car bunger. And then pass priority. Back to you. What is that, a mask or a double mask? Uh, that's a character. Oh, okay, so that's in the use then. Yeah. Could you not feel, could you not afford to field it? Or... I could, didn't want to. No, fair enough. Okay. Um, I'm going to play that on him, so he gets plus four on overcrush. 12, eight, overcrush. I'm, I'm going to let him through. Okay, nice. I wondered if you might, but uh, sure. Yeah, I think I think it's my best move. I don't know. I could be wrong. Well, uh, I mean, you lose your whole field. Well, you you wouldn't have lost your whole field, but you're going to lose most of it. So, right, two. If you hadn't have knocked that psychic out, you could have just defended with everything. But then you do lose your whole field. But he's gone now, so. Right. Well, no, but you, you're all, you're fast, so you would have just knocked him out. No, they're they're only um only Deadpool characters. Oh, so only himself. That's true. Yeah, sorry. So yeah, but you wouldn't have been able to. Uh, yeah, yeah. So you you would have still lost him. Yeah. Okay. Right, that was all useless. That was rubbish. So I'm gonna spend one to re-roll all of that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Better. Right. I think with for me with multiple manies he costs a lot to field. He does, he does. 
I'm hoping you can't do 20 in one go. Yeah, I did have half an eye on doing that, but... Look, it's, pretty sucky. It's uh, not really feasible. Right, let's pay. I'm going to pay another one, because... I'm getting all the level 1s and 2s. Yeah, that's Which, good for me. Yeah, true. Right, that's all right. Because I can go through for a fair chunk of damage. Mm -hmm. Not quite 12, but you know. 20. <laughs> 12, oh yeah, 12. Not right. interested. I'll pay for two. Just buy a cowabunga, then they all get plus one. Yeah, but that's, that's the way for... Yeah, cowabunga. This is now the cowabunga meta. Um, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Although, to be fair, actually, I do not want you getting your last cow bunker, so I'm going to ping one off and pay two to buy a cow bunker. Mm -hmm. which... no, one, no one's ever said that before. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well, maybe they have. I don't know. I've just never never seen it used, but... That's that. I mean, okay. plus one across the board is pretty strong. Yeah. <coughs> with, with your tactics, that could be enough to... To kill me. Yeah, true. Uh, do I want to put if I put him out? It doesn't matter either oh. way. Um, yeah, you can just go through to used, and then I'll pay two to fill that. Uh, um, and then I'll pass priority. Pass back. I'll go through for six. Six. Okay. I mean, it's half of 12. Yeah. Right. One in the bag is the Black Widow. I mean, she's, if nothing else, she's going to just be uh, um, making your stuff smaller, which is good for me. Uh, or give me energy. Wow. Okay. So if I can do something with masks, in theory, that is six. But my stuff isn't masks. It's bolts mainly. There's a bolt. Okay. So field him. I can then in theory buy a six cost bolt character. Which I don't I got red eyes. Thins your field out. Five cost is Merlin. I think Merlin is just going to be the quick and easy way to go now. Merlin. Do I? Yeah, because I can prep then. So, yeah, so I bolt him off. I just picked up a Merlin there, but I pick him off. I need to do that anyway. One, two, three for the Merlin, and then I'll just do a prep. Uh, which is oh, it is a cowabunga. Okay. Right. Okay. Right. That is good. Luckily for you, I will not be getting definitely not be getting a Merlin next turn because I've got six in my bag. Oh, only one, only one swarm. That's not great for me. That's quite poor. That's shocking. In fact, we've... fantastic. Yeah, that's because <laughs> that could have been <coughs> last turn. Yeah. Right, okay. Cabung on it, yeah. Yeah. Mm. So it's five, 16. six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirty. Yeah, I think I might win. That's it, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and then yeah, Cowabunga. <sighs> and that's five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. Oh, blast! That is annoying. Because I would have been, yeah, I would have been possibly drawing a Wolverine again. Yeah, right, I'm just gonna, just gonna torture myself and go. All right, let's shuffle them up. No, I didn't. Okay, okay. So, fine. so two in my bag was these two. Oh, that's that's pretty brutal. Yeah. I mean, ultimately, I could have been attacking with a four psychic, and you would have realistically had to block it. Yes. 
Um, so, or even let's let's just roll all sidekicks. No, I didn't. Okay, cool. That'd been also quite funny. Well, I didn't think I would win. I came closer than I thought I would <laughs> by quite some way. Um, uh, yeah. So next turn could have been potentially like that, which would have been bad for you in all ways, all manner. So, because all I really needed was him out on any level. Yeah. Yeah. Level level one's three, so he would have been a seven. Yeah, unblockable. So. That would have uh, finished you off, or yeah. even level level five, and I could uh, level three, and I could have actually filled his other stuff because he's a five. That would have been a six. So yeah, that was that was better than well. I mean, it's better because of the fact that I actually got to Wolverine early. That that term one prep is this. Well, going back to current real life times, the master mold is a term one prep. So. Chasey, you probably don't actually even need to, the term on prep. No, I mean, like the. Sorry, the Sinister Global. It just guarantees it, I suppose. Yeah. Um, but yeah, I bought him on turn two, didn't I? Or yeah. Was it, turn three? it might have been turn three, but. I oh, know, it must have been turn two because you did your turn one prep. Yeah, yeah, that's true. Because I bought her and, yeah, did a turn. Yeah. So. Yeah, crazy. Crazy. Yeah. And I made the right move by uh, letting him through for 12. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, I mean, it's always a risk. Uh, yeah. But I can't, can't not attack with a 12 because... Oh, no. You know, it still took you two turns to, to get to that point. Yeah, and if I didn't if I didn't roll the uh, cow bunga, then again, I've rolled <laughs> everything. If I, I drew fairly <laughs> poorly that turn yeah. as well. So, but yeah, no, yeah. If, if I hadn't managed to get to lethal at that turn, then you, you could have well taken me the next turn. Yeah. yeah. <coughs> yes. The uh, so yeah, some good new cards there. Uh, didn't really see Wolverine's ability, but it's nasty. <laughs> it's not nice, uh, as you well know. Multiple yeah. man was quite fun. I've never yeah, used well, it, and it's obviously very effective having that many swarmers. Oh, it is definitely. It's a. Uh, it's definitely a useful card. It's just, uh, it's keeping. You, you were lucky to roll quite a lot of psychics as well. Yeah. Keeping keeping the character in the field when there's other stuff attacking against you, it can be quite annoying. Plus, obviously, I could have put, I should have put more, um, magic missile on as one of mine because mm. magic missile against him is it, it annoying. It you know. Yeah. And I've got I've got bulk characters as well, so I could easily have done it. Um, admittedly, I've got. My cheapest bulk character is five, but you know. <laughs> <laughs> um, but no, that's just a, that was a a decent matchup. Just a matter of speed on these two. Um, the only thing with Cowabunga, from my point of view, is it meant that I only had could only have one thing in the field. Yeah. Which, you know, as you know, if you haven't if you haven't got to block, then take it. Life is a resource. Yeah. So, yeah. So there you go. That was a that was a good, decent, decent, decent game. Actually, a rel relatively short one. I thought it'd be quicker, uh, slower. Um, but actually, with yours having ramp, you was always going to have the speed advantage. Um, but yeah, always good to see him back in the fold. Um, so yeah, that was. Uh, that was that round. So the next one, and the next one gets confusing because it's, I think, um, let's have a look. Uh, so we've got, I think it's like two or three team packs now. Oh no. Uh, okay, no, actually, I've got Heroes in a Half Shell. So we're going back to the second Turtles set. After that, we have Iron Man, War Machine, Starter Pack, and Defenders. So I guess, do you want to roll all three into one or do? Cause defenders yeah, uh, I think just do do one big one because otherwise, Iron Man, Iron Man, War Machine's got some decent stuff. Yeah. Um, I hear they're going to introduce a new mechanic called Suit Up, and then never touch it again. 
Uh, there, there is a suit up in the th Thor set. Spoilers. Um, How do you even so, know? I, I, you know, I've got I've got links to Jimmy and Wizards uh. and, and in fact, in the Batman set also. Uh, actually, I lie. There, there is only. Um, there is only one other card that has suit up, other than that set, which is in Batman. Which, looking at the, uh, looking at what they say is going to be in the Iron Man War Machine set, everything is suit up Iron Man. Well, most of it is suit up Iron Man, but Iron Man isn't in it. Oh. So, oh. from my sources tell me that there is a Hulkbuster Iron Man, mm. which has uh, all of these ones have suit up Iron Man. So it says when purchased, you may KO a character with the suit up requirement to field it at level two. So all of these ones are Iron Man, Hulkbuster Iron Man, Iron Manor, uh, and Space Armor. Uh, Iron Man, and they're all suit up Iron Mans. Um, and there's a War Machine, which is suit up Iron Man, but there isn't Iron Man in the actual set. Bizarre. Um, yeah. So then you have to go back in time to. So was there Iron Man? Must have been in Civil War. Yeah, Civil War. Or Age of Ultron. Or ADX, but yeah, we'll see how that works out. So we're going to roll. So what's in what's useful in that turtle set? Well, there, there's <sighs> the obvious. Yeah, there's um, metalhead. Metalhead and and um, April O'Neil and the turtle power and all of that. Yeah, but we saw Turtle Power in the first set. Yeah, but now I you've got the two costs. Yeah, I suppose the main thing is the two costs. But then you're building just the Turtle Oh, team. yeah, absolutely. <laughs> it's, um... Which what, probably won't win, maybe. So you've got um, another one which I've used is the Karai. Karai. So she's... When she's active, psychics can't attack. Is kind of big. Yeah, I or, can see that. Or while she's active, your psychic dice get plus one A and plus one one D, which is fun. Yeah. Again, but it's a four cost, so that's not fantastic. I believe that one of the Renatillies is useful. One or two. Okay, extra reroll. Useful. Uh, okay. While she's active at the end of your re roll and reroll step, you may spin any action die in your reserve pool on a non-energy face to any other face. That's, That's always nice. Quite strong here. Um, when fielded, you may move a die from your reserve pool to your use pool to roll a different die from your use pool and place it in your reserve pool. Again, that could be really fun. Other than that, you've got some. Oh, you got haymaker. Which is basically um, anger issues, momentum, yeah, always from mutation. Yeah. Oh, when you're uh, playing against someone who's got momentum going, it's so frustrating. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so frustrating, especially with PXG. Yeah, although you don't tend to use that one in that way, but nefarious broadcast. Oh, I hate that card. Uh, Splinter's teaching is fun. Unstable yeah. cast is the same as Magic Missile. I think that's the first reclaim is the first one of that um, move a die from your use pool to your prep area type one. Because they've done it again in the tur in the Thor set, I think. Um, mm, there's some good stuff in there, mainly the basics. But if you're playing turtles, you've got you've got Good stuff with um, April and Metalhead in that one. Um, 
I mean, we should probably just agree on who plays the Turtles team, shouldn't we? Um, yeah. <laughs> or there's, well, I don't know, Target Claw, when he attacks, still two target, do damage target opponent. Obviously, it's a slow burner. But... Well, yeah, yeah, yeah. Attack and distract. You know. uh, I mean, the, the seven cost one of Tiger Claw, though. When fielded, deal three damage to each opposing yeah, character. That is pretty though. mean. Yeah. Even then, three damage probably. I mean, it, it'll kill most things. But not big things. No, no, but it'll, it'll still do the damage. What's Slash? I can't remember ever. Oh, okay. Yeah, I've never ever seen Slash in my life. I mean, that's kind of fun, though. When he's blocked, deal damage equal to his attack, which is 3, 5, or 6 to a target opposing character type that is not blocking him before the combat damage. So if you've got a, an overcrusher yeah. and him, that that is useful. Uh, have you seen the new Turtles film yet? No, no. haven't been for oh, a while. Hmm, that's good. That's good. Yeah, the f better foot ninjas are in the other set. The better Casey Jones are in the other set. Yeah. Um, although, I mean, they're, they're, they're all reasonably decent. Oh, there is a must block, though. Well, it's only psychic characters, but that could be abused with overcrushes, couldn't it? Pay fist, target psychic character type, must block this turn if able. The global, and then you can spam something big and overcrushy. Like yeah. This. Um, yeah, there's some decent stuff. And then defenders. Is there any point in looking at defenders? No, they're pretty janky, aren't they? You've got really, really want to yeah. make a defenders team. Yeah, and there's only seven of them because Loki is in there, and he's a villain. The problem with the defenders is the same problem that the turtles have, is that most of them cost five or more. Yeah. Hellcats are three costs. Um, and if you can get a five cost Luke Cage, he then reduces them all by one. But you're still looking at a six cost becomes a five cost, a six or a seven cost, a seven cost, a five cost, a five cost. So, you get some um, Stu Stu Art, who's famous for his uh, defenders teams. Yeah, I mean he's got him sort of. I mean the Hellcat is annoying. So, uh, so you've got um, named when fielded named target opposing non psychic character replacing all previous choices. While Hellcat is active, deal two damage to your opponent the first time they field that character die. So it's so well active, so it doesn't go away. So if they field the character, then they just take two damage. Yeah. But then you've got to then KO her to then recycle her to do it again. Um, so it's, it's annoying early on. Um, the, yeah, the other, the, 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 uh, when field in name a die, your opponent cannot purchase that die next turn. So yeah, that's a bit annoying, but not the end of the world. Yeah, yeah, they're janky. Yeah, well, we'll definitely put them in with this next update. I mean, I'm tempted by turtles and then them to after, but um, it doesn't make much difference. Yeah, no, just get, let's get them out of the way. <laughs> let's get them out of the way. Yeah, so. We, you do Tails team, I'll do an Iron Man team. Sure. <laughs> a suit up team. Yeah. Let's just have a jank, historic jank week, yeah. I guess. Yeah, let's do it. Um, Sandy, I don't have that team pack, uh, that thingy, so. Uh, okay, well, that's fine. That'll do me nicely. Yes, yeah. That's cool. All right, yeah, that's easy then. I'll try and remember that. So, what, only from those sets, or? If, uh, do you want to do that? We can do that. Uh, can I have Iron Man? Yes. <laughs> that seems fair. Cool, thank you. <laughs> that would be annoying otherwise. Cool, I can have any Iron Man. Um, 
uh, and this team pack. All right, cool. Yeah, that sounds good enough to me. Um, cool. Well, uh, the only other thing to tell, talk, to remind people about, we've told everyone about it many, many times, is it is less than two weeks until Breath Weapon X Fest 6. Mm -hmm. Which means I should probably send off the design to get printed. Um, kind of want a copy of this one for myself as well. So I might get two unless you want one as well. Then I'll get three. Um, so yeah. Um, that's it. So yeah, less than two weeks. Pick a character, any character, as long as it costs three or more. And there's some other other bands. The bands are mainly to do with um, fielding like like Mr. J where if you field a, a character that matches the energy of an active character deal the person two damage, that's just not fun. Yeah. Um, most of the bands are like that. The other ones are like um, ones that buff each other. Again, it's, they're not fun. Because you just end up with massive Cree captains or mystiques, um, so yeah, anything like that, just just don't bring it. Um, yeah, basically, it's all about it's mainly about fun. You know, we don't want you to throw the games, but you do get more tickets for the raffle if you lose a game. Um, so it's only one difference, but you know it's. Just to kind of skew it a little bit, yeah, yep. Um, and then that's about it, yeah. So we'll see you next week. I think next week might maybe one of our pre-recorded episodes. Um, so if it is, again, we might see you in a couple of weeks for that for for the tournament. Then, so catch you next time. Then, yeah. See you later. Bye-bye.